Welcome back, my friends, to another YouTube video. Today's topic is How do I feel when I make content? How do I feel? I feel productive. I feel happy. It pleases me to produce content. I love what I do. I love showing my higher wisdom. Note, I did not say inner wisdom. Why did I choose higher wisdom? Why did I choose the word higher instead of inner? When I said higher, I literally mean from my higher self. Therefore, it also indicates inner wisdom because both words relate back to that of the soul. But for me, I prefer the word higher wisdom rather than inner. Higher promotes a powerful vibration that is better than the word inner. Inner, to me, it sounds like you are hiding something, a lower vibration. Inner usually means inner self. Inner, um, I don't know how else to explain that. Uh, inner closet, maybe. Like, I have a skeleton in my closet, um, and I finally came out of said closet. I think of inner, I think of that, like you are hiding something or in the closet about it. Or something. To me, the word inner is a lower vibration. I am more aware of how words affect me. Higher resonates better. It resonates stronger with me rather than the word inner. And that is why I say higher rather than inner to, to promote a stronger vibration. And that is why I do what I do, promoting my higher wisdom. It places me, it gives me great feeling to produce content, to share this with you all, to share this with the world. I am a light worker. It pleases me to make content, to share this with everyone, to help others, to inspire, to know that I have helped people and will continue to do so. My words are powerful. My words are love. My words are magic. My vibration is powerful. My vibration is healing. My words are healing. My vibration is powerful. My vibration is light. My vibration is love. For I am love. I am powerful. I am divine. I am magical. I am love. I am light. I am blessed. I have been blessed by doing my true well. I am blessed by doing the great work. And I will continue this great journey.
And that is why I do what I do. I love what I do. I am passing on it. I know I can speak better. I do get better with this video. I am still finding my energy in making these videos or any video for that matter in colouring the gaming videos. Recently I have shared an art video of how I made this picture and then I mirrored it. I love mirror mirror in the final photo. Then I get to make all these alien faces. It's, it's, the stars resonate with me. What can I say? And that is what I do. Why I do it. I love what I do. And I am happy to continue. Until I have no space left on my hard drive. Or when I decide to when to end it. I'm not sure yet. I'm thinking 200 gigabytes because I have add-ons and I have updates for my games left to do, to handle. Let me rephrase that. Steam, updates, arc, survival, evolved, add-ons, mods, and they'll game updates as well as... No, that's about it. No, I have this arc on this hard drive along with Steam. I might have Final Fantasy Morbius on this. I'm not entirely sure. Morbius, no, I don't know. Uh, off the top of my head, I know I bossed that name. Um, I don't know if I have any other Steam games other than Ark on that hard drive. I know I have others on a second hard drive, except that has like a hundred gigabytes of free space. And sometimes I move old art projects and old videos, uh, fractal animations that I have done onto this new hard drive just to get it off of my main. Uh, I will I will see what happens in the future for that. I am not certain how much longer I can make content because every new video is like over a gigabyte. Not joking. The original unedited video less than that. I will go on a random video and see the space being used. Um, 170 megabytes for one that I have not edited yet. And that will be like, I don't know, 9 gigabytes when it's done. I'm just randomly guessing at this point. So, I will check on my art commentary, uh, art video that I recorded. 544 megabytes unedited versus double. It doubled when it was edited. I don't know why. All I did was mix down the audio track and the audio edit. I don't think I used a uh, auto level to increase the brightness on that one. I don't think I did. The audio itself is only 15 megabytes. Why 
on Earth did it double? I don't know. Unless it is because of the intro, maybe. I don't know. Um, I exported as a Facebook free uh, free thing. Uh, a Facebook settings for that. So that's only in seven twenty, not ten eighty, not nineteen twenty. It's not on YouTube. It's on Facebook, which is seven twenty. And let me go suck the intro. The intro is only thirteen megabytes, so I don't know why it is doubling when all I do is mix down the audio, add the intro, and that's it. The intro is only ah, nine seconds. Long and the new one that I did is less, only five seconds long. And every time it's like double, if not triple. Unless it's be. No, I have no idea why the original unedited is half the fraction of the edited when I don't really do anything. Hmm. Though I'm not really a tech person on to know these things, so I will probably have to Google why an edited track is costs more space. So I might have to cut back on editing and just upload with no edit, with no fix of lighting. Right now it is very dark. Even though I have a light up here, you can kind of see it. Uh, the microphone it itself is very crystal, crystal clear. However, I do a small, very small edit on the audio. A pitch shift, I increase the bass and treble. I really need to actually re show that. <laughs> in a new video, like a quick thing on what I do now. But yeah, it's been fun making these videos, giving you background information on what I do without being asked. I just do it for the fun of it. And it just gives me the opportunity to, uh, what was I going to go with this? Yeah, more like, what was I going with that? Um, I don't know. Well, I was heading with that. Like I said, I'm not obsessive with how many viewers I have versus... I, basically, I am not obnoxious. I did this for fun. And I will continue to have fun with it. And until we meet again, my friends.